Bantam, senior referee. And this quartet we in charge of this important fixture as Malayne, just one place above the relegation zone, one point above the relegation zone as well, ahead of Treasure Beach. And this is how their opponent will shape up Fair United. Off Neil Reed, new between the sticks. No Roger Williams, that's a big miss. Brown, Beckford, Clark, Damian Thomas, newly into the starting lineup. Kemoy slowly. Nathaniel Howe, the schoolboy, Kareem McLean, Dunstan Cohen. The Denby United, Denby United, Denby High School star, uh, Tevon Salmon, as well as Daniel Daly, is how they'll shape up. Of course, they are coached by Linval Dixon, and they'll be playing with a 4-3-3. No Lamar Neal in the squad yet again. And you always worry when you don't see him in the squad. Him and Brown usually team up very well. Javier Brown. Malines United, this is their starting 11 force change, of course, as we said, with Jeremy Nelson being out. And Taraj Andrews comes into the starting lineup. Enrique Gordon, the exciting wing back, is there as well. Sergini Franson and, of course, the regular Peter Harrison between the sticks. Rashawn Livingston will partner Jason Wright up front. And Steve Reed comes into the midfield with Daniel Hardy and Javon Brown, who will play in front of the back four. The versatile midfielder Brown who has played left back this season. The relegation zone, 2-0 at full time over Bear United. Daniel Hardy and Rashawn Livingston, the man of the match. Any position. Full match highlights, Carvel Banton in charge of this one. Malines driving forward early in their full blue kit with yellow trim right to Wilson and Wilson dragging his shot wide. In the end, Malines looked more positive, especially in the first half. Didn't really have many opportunities, but a lot of action in and around the 18-yard area. That was Daniel Hardy's attempt found a little bit of space but was high and wide then this run from Howe the teenager think he should have scored going for the far post probably the right idea but give credit to Peter Harrison who did very well then Jason Wright second half heading into the ground should have done better and this from Beckford Beckford was more of a spectator pushy Beckford in the in this match 60 goal man in his Premier League career but he really had nothing going and that one was over the top then this the first goal to break the deadlock after 49 minutes great pass from Wilson Hardy's first touch was magnificent the way he took it down and his finish clinical with the right boot into the far corner Reed had no chance and Malines were off and running then Jason Wright using his strength well to get into the area it came again to Wilson who waited his pass superbly into the path of Rashawn Livingston who would score his first goal of this season. Malign second after 57 minutes. Their tall number 11 with the Sportsmax at moment of the afternoon. 2 nil Malign and three points in the back. They had five shots on target from their eight attempts compared to just one on target from six. 24 fouls between the two teams. It was a pretty bit of a busy afternoon in the end for Carvel Banton. He showed four yellow cards as well. Three of them to the green and yellow of Vare. Their goalkeeper made majority of the saves of Neil Reed. He made three of them but couldn't keep out the two goals scored by Malines, who had the majority of the possession as well. And all the points in this Monday afternoon fixture. Malines United 2, Vare United nil. And they stretch their points further up the table with 11 points now, still in 12th position. And let's hear from our man of the match, Rashawn Livingston, who is with Ligier Williams. Rashawn Livingston, today's man of the match. It was a beautiful goal from you today. Walk us through that first. Uh, the goal, the goal, well, it was been working hard in training, you know. Uh, work, working, working in the final third. Never getting it right, you know. Uh, tonight, we come, came, came out strong and get the job done. And caps are uh, off to the lads, you know. And it's the first goal of the season. I, I think that Malines, you know, they need you to really come and score some goals, get some assists. Did you feel like there was a burden off your back to get that goal? Well, yeah, yeah. You know, you know we get one, so uh, we have many more, many, many more to come. Yeah, I only can go forward from here. And it's been a tough start to the season so far, but you're gaining some momentum now. What is the mood like in the camp, especially after this win? Uh, the, the mood in the camp, well, 
you know, it, 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 it not go perfect, but every, everything getting together well right now. As, as you can see, we're playing better, enjoying, enjoying the game. Yeah, so it's kind of more free. You know. All right, great win, great goal, and best of luck for the rest of the season. All right, thanks. Sir. So now we're moving on to the coaching staff of Vare United. It's going to be their head coach, Linval Dixon. <laughs> 